Good morning, everyone. Jeannie here, and welcome back to my channel. So today I went over to CVS. So absence really makes the heart go fronder. But what got me into CVS was two things. My razors are rusty, <laughs> so we need to replace them. And I had a 25% off coupon. So um, my go-to place for razors is always CVS. And especially the weeks where I need to kind of like stretch the grocery budget as much as I can um, to stay in budget. So that is what I did. So I'm going to walk you through my CVS haul. So if you guys have not already subscribed to my channel, make sure you click that red subscribe button below. Um, and if you're new to my channel, welcome. Um, I used to post a lot of CVS content, um, but I just got into a really bad place in the uh, back in December, like early December, I was just in a very bad head space and um, since then I have taken some time for myself I have really focused on my relationship with God and really just focusing on what I needed to do so I had a little bit of a break um, with CVS and Walgreens but now I think it's about time that we get that going again so um, if you guys are looking forward to seeing some CVS and Walgreens content back here on the channel, please let me know in the comment section below, because my goal here on this channel is to bring you guys the content you want to see. So um, if that is something you're interested in seeing here back on my channel, let me know. I know that there are a ton of CVS couponers out there. I know there are a ton of Walgreens coupons out there, but I think that I bring um, something unique to the game in terms of CVS and Walgreens, because I really try to roll my extra care box into um, other things that I need in the household. So um, let's go ahead and talk about the haul. So my first transaction, I had a 25% off um, purchase. So I got that through the mail. And um, anytime that you see like percentage off coupons, you want to buy things that are not on sale. So you want to look for tags that say buy um, and make sure they are regular price, make sure they are not clearance. So uh, the first deal I did was on razors because that's what I needed the most uh, because my current razor is rusted and I only use the Mach 3. So um, I picked up two of the razors. So the Gillette Mach 3 was priced for $9.99 and then the Venus razor was priced for um, $10.49. And I had a uh, four off one coupon for Venus with my CVS app. And then I also had a four off one for the Gillette. So that took $8 off. I know that there are PNG coupons um, in today's inserts, but we don't get the PNG um, here in our newspaper. So I wasn't able to take advantage of that. Um, so that made for a really good deal. And then I wanted to go ahead and utilize the CoverGirl coupon. So I had a three off one I coupon in my CVS app, but then I also had an insert coupon from today's smart source. So um, CoverGirl is buy two, get a $5 extra care buck. So I picked up one of the um, lash curlers. So the lash curlers were priced for $5.59. And then the um, tried and true brow pencils are $5.99. So I picked both of those up. I used a three off one insert coupon, and then I also used used a three off one app coupon for that. And then I wanted to use my Revlon coupon. So um, Revlon is spend 12, get eight. And I had that buy one, get one free eye coupon. So I picked up two of the primers. I absolutely love the eyeshadow primer. It works really well. Um, so I picked two of those up and I used a buy one, get one free coupon. So in total, um, I got 25% off after all of my coupons and extra care bucks because I had a $2 extra care buck from like last week or the week before that. Um, so my percentage off coupon took $7.02 off. So my final total was um, $24.36, but I got um, $4 back for the Revlon. I got $5 back for the CoverGirl, and then I got $8 back for the Razor. So then I rolled it into my next transaction, um, and picked up some things that we needed in the house. So um, we like when I say that we are low on laundry detergent, I had one pod left to do our laundry last night. So um, Target or so CVS has the um, Tide Pods priced for four dollars and ninety four cents. So I picked two of the pods up. Um, and then I had a dollar app coupon for the Tide. And then I also had a two off eight CRT for Tide. So that took a total of three dollars off. And then I picked up four 12 counts of eggs. So these were priced for uh, $2.89. And if you guys didn't know, you can use extra care bucks on eggs because eggs are not dairy, they are poultry. So 
um, I went ahead and rolled all of my extra care bucks into this transaction. So I ended up paying a dollar and 97 cents after tax. So I was able to get four 12 packs of eggs, two laundry detergents, and then some of the um, beauty and personal care that you saw here. So um, for my first CVS haul back, I think I did really well. My best strategy that I like to do is um, make a list of the things that I know we need. Like if I know we're gonna leave laundry detergent, if I know we need eggs, if we need some dairy-free milk, if we need um, some sort of like paper product, I will make that list. And then I'll go to the extra care book offerings because they have really good offerings for things like makeup and razors and shampoos and stuff. Like we always get really good extra care bucks on those. Um, so then I'll start making my deals that way. But my favorite time to do those deals is definitely when it's the, um, percentage off coupons because I find that those are really good coupons. So um, let me go ahead and share with you guys my receipt because I I want you guys to see like how these deals actually work out for me. So uh, my first receipt, it was $24.36 for the first transaction. Um, and then the last transaction receipt. And then my final transaction is that dollar and 97 cent receipt right there. So this was everything that I picked up over at my CVS. And um, again, you guys, let me know in the comment section below if this is something you want to see back on my channel so that I know, because I don't want to create content that you guys are not interested in watching because it's just a waste of time to make videos you guys don't wanna watch. So um, let me know in the comment section below and I will talk to you guys all very soon. Bye guys.